is the Raven, and we are using the Egg Base's less popular cousin footprint, the Football Footprint, as shown here. And it is a super nice, super easy bunker base that can be done on console and anything like that. And it's just completely expandable into a compound. We have a uh, reasonable, very cheap upkeep of under 40 HQM and around 7k metal that is including all of this with all the deployables shown here and around 8k stone a 31 rocket raid but of course that can be upgraded but it is under 40 hqm so it's super nice and it's super similar to building you're starting with your tc on one triangle doesn't matter where you place that triangle just like this whenever you claim your area you're going to come off that tc triangle with another triangle just like this and you can put two squares on either sides of those triangles and then you're gonna put two triangles just like this. I'm gonna surround everything but here, except we're going to do our double half wall so we can have our bunker that cannot be mollied out. And then we can put our door here just like this. And just like this, you can put yourself a shelf here. Just like this in a second door so you don't get uh, deep done. Just like this. That's your stage one of your base and you can outfit it however you want with whatever you want. Um, and then once you put your stage two, you can create something like this to jump up, but you're gonna put a wall right here. And that was supposed to be upgraded and this was not supposed to be here. And once you have a jump up right here, um, you can choose whichever direction you want to go. But we, we want our bunker for our exit, for our second bunker, just like this, just like the intro. And we're going to put double half wall there. And then now we can put a twig floor here and this. And that's going to seal our bunker upwards, just like that. And it will just be behind an armor door and a garage door, but again, it's gonna be super nice and super easy. And this is basically your stage two, just like this. And you could have a twig jump up wherever you want. And go ahead and get ready to expand. You're gonna upgrade your TC, preferably to maximum before you start uh, going over everything. Then you just do two squares on the outside of your TC for your loot rooms. And upgrade everything accordingly here. And you do want a half floor inside of your squares for your loot rooms, just like this. So however you want to build that, if you want to build it first, just like this, and then upgrade everything around it. But you're just gonna go ahead and upgrade that. And upgrade this honeycomb in here, ensuring that you leave this, you upgrade this one to metal if you can. When you seal it off before you seal it off. And once you do that, you can do a square on this. And again, you can upgrade that to metal. So that one's not too necessary. We upgrade this to a full square, just like this. Demolish this. Start putting your honeycomb around here. And you just want your full squares off the two center single triangles, just like this, for your exits. And you're going to have a window and two single door frames, just like this. And you just need to honeycomb the sides. That one, we're going to use a triangle ramp to get our jump up to our doors. So you just need to honeycomb this. And this is our core that uh, we were supposed to leave. Yeah, we have room to upgrade that back one. So we don't have boxes there, but you should leave a box empty or you have to pick up a box. Um, and just continue the honeycomb. Just like this, and then you're gonna uh, just put the foundations for your triangle roofs there. All right, now once you have all of the honeycomb walls placed and your two squares, for your jump ups and your entrances on your center triangles um, 
built out like this. Just like this. We're going to wall off the path uh, whichever direction like this. Actually, we want a loot room. Just like this are two big loot rooms. And then these are also going to be like locker honeycombs. Just like that. And since your bunker entrance is already set up there, everything here is just sealed off. Just like that, and you can do the same thing here. Upgrade these. And then upgrade this. And this is supposed to be a uh, honeycombed as well. All these on the back of your big your big loot rooms. You want all of this honeycombed. Just like this, you could upgrade your loot rooms to metal. And we do add another layer of honeycomb, just like this. So we can have our chute and our second floor bunker metal as well. HQM the first floor. Add your loot rooms, however you want to do them, just like this. And again, garage door and then double door right here, flipping outwards, so you have an airlock right here. And then garage door spam. Same thing on that side, garage door all in the center. Actually, we're gonna make the jump up towards like this and put a window right here and have a double, so you have an airlock up here, just like this. And here you have your stage two slash three. And we're just gonna, we forgot to put the extra honeycomb right here. All right, now that everything's properly honeycombed, just like this, um, this is where you're gonna want to put your uh, external TCs. We'll just go ahead and speed things up with stone here. And you're gonna come to your double, your all triangle sides right here, your jump up side and your just complete hexagon side. Where these two triangles are, uh, I guess I should have stayed in twig for right now. And you do a wide gap. So you're gonna build out two triangles, or one triangle, two triangles, two squares, whatever, and then so you can get a center square build out. You can do three squares and a triangle, just like this. And you do that on both sides. That one's really bushy. But we're gonna break everything except for that last triangle. And since so we can see it better, come back with just a single hexagon, two square, or a single square. Single hexagon, single square, and then double square like this, triangle, square, triangle, triangle. Break the square triangle, triangle, square, triangle, however you want to do it. Get your wide gap going just like this. Squares to stone, triangles to sheet metal. Break the rest of the twig including this one that's in the dirt somewhere there. There we go. Just like that. That one's a bit, that one's gonna have to be a half height above. But again, just bring, pull out your three squares, wide gap. Bring it around. Just like that. Then we're gonna attach these to our TC without four twig and a triple triangle. Do not upgrade the center one. Let's place our external TC. We didn't place our middle or first TC, but we did. Place our external TC, demolish that. 
Do I upgrade everything to stone? Do you external PC? Just like this. And we are just going to connect it with just our gatehouse so it doesn't decay first. Now, Pan, I just destroyed the TC. Fantastic. Leave that empty triangle. Leave it like this. Leave it connected right here. And then we can add our bunker to our window later. And now none of this will be decaying once we put our wall frames for our shooting floor. Uh, just do the inside ones just like this, two floors up, all stone. Again, same thing on the other side, just like this, two floors up. Uh, looks like I'm going to need just a half floor. I'm going to bring this down. I'm going to bring this whole thing down one second. All right, and just do the same thing on the other side. Just like this, two stories up. And you can put your floors on either side, whichever one you want. To create whatever kind of gaps you want, whether you want them forward or backwards or even and odd, just like that. And again, you would just mimic that same external TC on that side. And then we would just do our double garage door. triangle frames like this above the windows with doors single doors like this and single doors right there garage door right here towards your wide gaps single doors on the side half wall window for your roof half wall half wall then you do windows all on your wide gaps around everything with windows except for this is the door because you're going to have your triangle roof just like this for your jump up and on this frame for your grenade throwdowns just like this we're just going to match the floor with our wide gaps just like this Seal up our floor using our roof as our uh, jump up right here. Seal up this first floor. Windows right there. Just like that. And we are doing half walls on each of our four corner sides right here by our wide gaps. And then another jump up. Like this above our squares. Just like this. And we're doing a second shooting floor. More windows over here. Just like this. Put your windows on all your half walls for your triangles. Window, door frame, window, door frame to access them. And you can do a triple garage door entrance just like this. Using the windows on each side for a nine rocket raid. And then you can spam garage doors or have it leave it open here for a farm or whatever you want. And you're just going to go ahead and fill out your floor plan, floor pattern, seal everything up. And on this one, you want to extend this over like this. You want to extend your hexagons for your final shooting floor over into your wide gap, just because we'll have roof pieces here and they won't be able to access those. Then we want a single floor here, triangle floor, sorry, and a low wall, triangle floor and low wall on each of these. This is going to be our jump up. And we want roofs and all of our triangle peaks right here. And 
and you can do your ball just like this. Looks like I need another. We're gonna do a half ball. I think I did a half ball too. Yeah, I don't think I, I think I'm supposed to do a full wall right there. That's my apologies. Then a half wall. Then a full wall. Yeah. Then a full wall. Two full walls. And then a half wall in the back. That's what it is on your square roof. Instead of this half wall above right here, we need two full walls. That is my uh, my apologies right there. Sometimes I get the height wrong. There we go. Now, once you have this, then you can go ahead and put all of your roof pieces right here. Uh, my apologies, you need to do the triangle ones first. So you're gonna do all of you, you're gonna do these roof pieces for your crow wings on your roof. Just like this. And then you're gonna do these for these square ones. You can't place those square ones first. Then you're gonna cover your roof just like this. And then you can't put a roof up here and then like this. So it's uh, internally facing. It's still nothing above the roof and then you can put some turrets over here under these or whatever you wanna do for a very nice, very easy shooting floor. Super easy. And then we'll go ahead and do really quickly the bunker for this again. You would just do your two squares out. Triangle, two squares out. Four triangles to the left, square. Oops, square triangle. Four triangles to the left, square triangle. And that is after going out, triangle, two square. Just like that. You break everything except for that last triangle you place and make it a diamond with another triangle, no wall. Center it up, back it up towards the rope. I wasn't supposed to upgrade that. I messed it up, but whatever, just like squeeze forward. It's really easy to find it. Um, I say that as I get 70, we want 79, just like eyeball it, just like this. Right there, 79, way easier than to build out, but you just need this triangle that way out here, otherwise you get errors and it tries to snap towards this one if you don't have this build out. But uh, once you do that, and I broke the foundation, but you would just change that to a triangle. And then you would go ahead and build out one more bedroom for right here for your compound. And I just put just like a single, just like a random bedroom, no one, or just like a battery area. Just like that, right in front of your doorway. And then you would put your walls in between each of these for your nice compound. And you can do windows or whatever, but again, this is just a bedroom, like a defense point. You could put windows in Patrigal Peaks, but I just like to do a single square for a nice small compound. Again, super nice, super easy, 